Ten Hui, a former Hong Kong lawmaker, showed up at a photo exhibition for Hong Kong's freedom and democracy in Perth on June 11. He urged the Hong Kong migrants in Australia to unify and fight for those who have lost their freedom in Hong Kong. I feel the need of uniting Hong Kongers, putting Hong Kongers together when they're overseas. I hope that I can help and empower Hong Kongers' organisations and so that Hong Kong groups and the Hong Kong communities can become more powerful and become more influential. The photo exhibition, with nearly 100 artworks, brought people to the anti-extradition movement in 2019, where millions of Hong Kongers gathered to defend freedom but were met with rubber bullets and tear gas bombs from police. Many freedom fighters have been arrested in Hong Kong since the introduction of Hong Kong national security law in June 2020. Hong Kong has become so unrecognisable. The freedom has already gone. The promises made by Beijing, so-called one country, two systems, no, it's a lie. Now it's one country, one system. Some had to exile, including Ted Hui, but continued to be a voice for the Hong Kongers in the fight against the Chinese communist regime. As an exile, as a former politician, as a Hong Konger, I understand that there are things we need to do when we're overseas. I feel it's my lifelong mission to fight for Hong Kong, to speak up for Hong Kong and be the voice of Hong Kong. Ted Hui hopes that the Australian people and government can help Hong Kongers in their battle for Hong Kong freedom. And there are things that Australian government can do uh, to talk about sanctions. I mean, this gay act has been passed, and I wish that the government, Australian government, would really make use of that and punish the wrongdoers uh, in mainland China, the Beijing and Hong Kong officials. The photo exhibition is a part of a global campaign to commemorate the third anniversary of the anti-extradition action in Hong Kong.